Uh, I wanted to post a video about one of the major themes um, of A Country Wife and that theme is uh, disguise or deception is perhaps another way to um, to look at it. Um, disguise is a very well established kind of theatrical convention. Shakespeare used it. Um, it was used, in, you know, for comic effect in many many other um, sort of uh, genres of, of theatre throughout the ages. And if you just look up disguise um, on YouTube, you'll find some pretty interesting uh, examples of the kind of things that I'm talking about. Uh, however, disguise as it relates to um, a country wife, the country wife, um, uh, the there are many occasions within the play that uh, main characters wear disguises. So Marjorie Pinchwife will wear a disguise, she's disguised as a man. Um, Harcourt disguises himself as a priest. Uh, later on Marjorie disguises herself again as her sister, Elithia. Um, uh, on a deeper level though, so they're all physical kind of examples of disguise, but on a much deeper level, uh, many of the characters, if not all of them, are masking their true emotions and their true intentions from the other characters within the play, especially characters uh, like um, Horner and Harcourt, these rake characters. So um, I guess you could argue that the rake characters, the kind of socially sophisticated characters of the play, were the ones that were most adept, the best at kind of um, seeing through disguises and also being able to mask their own intentions and their own emotions through disguises. Um, it's worth at this point just discussing very quickly uh, what the idea of mask actually is. So if you look up Persona on the internet, and I'll try and leave a link below this video so you can do that. Persona is a Latin word uh, that literally means the masks that we wear. So my persona right now is a mask that I am wearing specifically for the purpose of putting up a video on YouTube to you guys. Uh, when I, in a minute, when I turn the camera off and I go and do something else and speak to my mate, I'll be wearing a different mask because I'm doing a, a different thing. And, and if you think about that, that's very true of all people. We, we react differently in different social situations. So in many given, you can argue then that how good you are at changing masks and changing personas, uh, that will mean that you are a more kind of successful person if you like, and characters like Horner and Harcourt are able to move um, quickly between different personas within the play, uh, and that is very much to their kind of social advantage. So look up what um, persona means on the internet, look up what mask means, uh, not just mask spelled in the traditional fa um, fashion, but mask spelled um, M-A-S-K. U E mask as in a masquerade ball um, and it will give you some very interesting reading uh, it really really will because the idea of masks um, it pops up again and again and again and again in, in, in the country wife and it is definitely a dramatic metaphor it's more than just a dramatic convention it's a dramatic metaphor for the emotional um, um, kind of disguises or the, the, the facades that the characters are putting on uh, throughout the play to try and fool and dis deceive each each other. So there you go, a quick point about masks. If you can get ideas like that into your answers, uh, then you know you're gonna show you the examiner that you really kind of understand your biscuits and you know what you're on about. So there you go, masks. Uh, I'll see you next time. Bye.